have to remove this bolt right there. One bolt right there. And there should be another bolt up there. See right there. Remove those bolts. I pop this off. You know, don't don't pull it all the way because you can break it, but pop this off. <clears throat> and pop this off too. Then what you gonna do from here, you're gonna pull it this way, like pull it. Now after you pull it, you're gonna bring it up. You know, bring it up so you can get out of here from the side. Like you see the door, I can't, it's still closed, so. Okay, and uh, the other thing you gotta do, unplug this connector right here. And I'm gonna show you back here what I did. Hold on. Okay. So <clears throat> we got this thing open. What you gotta do is, uh, I don't know if you can see. You're gonna pop this thing off out of the way. You know, pop. You know, for a little clip right there. Just pop this out, out of the way. Place this a little top right here down, and then you pop. Release one of the. Uh, release this one right here. Place the wire right here. And then the same thing on the other side right here on the handle. Let me see if you can see. I don't know if you can see that right there. But the other one goes right here. Remove this little clip, you know, just pull it that way. Push this one that way. And you release the other wire, the other cable. So both be loose. Now, what we're gonna do is gonna pull it the whole thing. The whole thing out. Let me see if I can get these seats all the way down. Like, so you let you, let you release all the way. And then pop this thing out of the way. Okay, so we got this out. Okay guys, after you get the panel off, you remove the, this gray plastic right here from the top. Remove that little screw in here. This one right here, it's a little one. And then what you're gonna do is gonna pop it from the top from here. Pop it out like that. And then from the back here, you know, it goes slide in here in the, in the other part of the plastic and then you just pop it. When you pop it, you get it out, you slide it this way like that and then it should come off. Now, now we can get this, uh, this locked. Yeah, we just can take this one to the, we just can take this thing to the, uh, to Luxme with the blankie. And then uh, that should save you some money. And, um, well, but um, I mean, in this case, you have to have the scanner to, to uh, program the key. Other than that, it's just going to be better. If you can take the whole car to the uh, to locksmith and let him do it, you know. But the cheaper way should be it just get the get the right key for it, a blank key, on Amazon or whatever. Whenever you get it, and if you can take the car to them, like tow or whatever, take to them and they should do the uh, key. I mean, I know it's kind of headaches, but it's up to you if you want to save some money or, or you know spend all. Just call them, let them make the key. I do this way because. I just trying to save some money on this one, so. Yeah, but uh, you know, we got this lock. With this lock, this is a 07. So with this, uh, this lock right here, they can make another key for you if you don't have any key, so. Yeah, I hope this tips, you know. Or maybe, I mean, uh, if the door is, I mean, this door, I'm not sure, but it won't. It will, I, I try to play with that thing, but it won't do nothing. I mean, it won't let him open it. So I'm going to make the key first, and then I'm going to try to see what I can do with the door. All right, guys. So peace. I hope this video helped you, and I'll see you next time.